Pulse Man's Bean again. Hello and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. Today we have a big, I'd say actually very big, uh, Sheen haul or Sheen, 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 Sheen. So I know that there's a lot of hype around Sheen moment but we are bougie on a budget here which means that this is the only place that we can afford right now. But yeah, if you want to see a lot of brown shit, then keep on watching and let's start. So the first thing that I want to start off with is actually what I've got on here. Um, and it's this brown tracksuit, which is very much giving me essential vibes. But let's be honest, not all of us can afford to spend £100 on a tracksuit that's going to be out of fashion in a month. So why spend hundreds when you can spend £25? You know what? Like, considering that this was £25 for the full tracksuit, I'm sort of impressed with it. Like just the whole thing i don't know there's something about it i feel like it fits really nicely it is a little bit high-waisted but i mean we move and it's got pockets which is a big thing i've got pockets down here i've got pockets up here most women's clothing doesn't come with pockets because they want you to carry a bag around which is really annoying because then you have literally nowhere to put your shit but this one actually comes with like all of that so i'm quite impressed I have already wore this. I wore this for Valentine's Day, so I'll insert a little photo of how I styled it and everything like that. So number two, we're focusing mainly on the trousers for this one. I've kept the hoodie on, even though I have got a couple tops to go along with these trousers. Um, I just wanted to show you them first. So it was these brown flared... I don't know if you can see the bottom here. We'll go up. So it's these brown flared leggings. I'm going to insert a photo now of how they were supposed to look. Um, these were a happy little accident because if you can see it doesn't look like on me how it looks like on the model for some reason these trousers like literally <laughs> they're either made for someone with a six foot torso or Simon Cowell because these are just not vibing with me like they're far 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 too long I don't understand why these trousers are so like long on the torso because on the leg they're not even that long like for me these are quite short which is saying something i've been looking for a pair of brown flared leggings as well for a while but ones which aren't see-through i find that that is the hardest battle and i think these ones were 11 pound 11.99 or 12 pound which is really good going for some leggings that aren't you know i don't know why i'm rubbing my ass i say i'm rubbing my ass and rubbing my non-existent ass but yeah so yeah i actually really like these and i thought you guys would like them too so i bought a couple tops to style them with so we're gonna move into them now keep looking at myself over here because i'm looking at myself in the mirror but this top just like makes me feel some kind of way it gives me very vivian westwood corset vibes especially with like the brown detail in here but i really love the vibes of this top i feel like it's so flattering everything about it is good like i could really see myself wearing this and I did buy this with the intention of pairing it with these flared brown leggings. So that's what it looks like. I actually picked up a couple accessories for this outfit as well. So I'm going to grab them now. The first thing I got which I actually do love is this bag. This bag was like £6. I know you'll have seen it. It's giving me major Bottega vibes. Um, I think that's sort of what these bags are inspired from. You know the little Bottega clutches. Obviously just with a handle. But I do love these. You can fit them over the shoulder and you can you know wear them i got cream because that's my most classic color that's probably the one that i would wear most cream or pink but in the case of like i've literally bought so many brown stuff today that i felt like the cream would be best in addition to that right i got some sunglasses and i don't want anyone to laugh at me when i put these on because i just i hadn't i don't know i really don't know how i feel about these you ready are you ready okay come in <laughs> Like, I don't know, do you know what, I, know, I, I can see the vibe I was trying to go with, like, I do see the vibe, but it's just, have I executed it? No, I don't think so. There's just something about it, like, I get major Matrix vibes. I mean, like, look, I wear them up here, this is what I look like. Like, that is ridiculous. So I'd have to wear them, like, down at my nose, like this. And then when I wear things down my nose, I don't know if it gives me, like, mysterious vibes or just nonce. I just I don't know how I feel about these I never thought in my life that I would say this but I feel like my head is too small um, and that's coming from someone with a pretty big head as well like my head is huge that's adorable I'm actually I am feeling myself right now I'm not gonna lie I really don't want to take this off oh my god we are going to ignore the fact that I fake tanned um my arms and my legs for this video and I didn't fake tan my belly <laughs> oh she looks so pale 
Okay, so this top was again another one that I bought to intend to go with these trousers. Now looking back, I don't think they owe the trousers as much, but I am going to find something to do with them. And it's like this, I don't know, it's like this collared, cropped, sleeveless, like zip up top. There's something about it, like the vibes it gives me is very Princess Diana slash Prada Sport slash we're sort of going on a secret mission. But no, there is something that I do I love about this top. I don't know when it's going to get worn because it is giving me more spring summer vibes. And I know that I said I didn't think brown personally was going to be carried into spring summer. But when you wear it with a top like this that like gives the vibes, then yeah, it probably is going to. But I will love this. I am going to wear it some point when I don't exactly know. But it's life in it. I don't know. It's just, I don't know, just feeling it. But... I'm sort of not feeling my arms in this outfit, like I have to keep my arms up because if I don't it gives me major like saggy. I'm going to keep my hair back for this one. The finale of this tops, I'm not sure. Part of me feels like I look like an extra of Lion King the Musical and that's just how I feel and I really can't escape it. I really wanted this top in white and I've seen it in white and I was like oh my god yes that is white. It's everything that's a little bit of me, it's cropped, long sleeved and fur like I love that for me. The white was sold out and I thought, well do you know what, maybe that's a good thing because typically if you're going to get something white from like Sheen or Pretty Little Thing or places like that, it's going to be see-through which means that my nips were going to come out. Uh, which is, I mean, through the nipple and all that, like woo go nipples, but it's just, it's not my vibe, I prefer to keep them away. Just, I don't know. I feel like I look like Mufasa. Um, it said chocolate brown and I would argue that this part is maybe chocolate brown, but like this is orange. This is orange to me and I'm sort of not vibing with orange so I don't actually know if I'm going to keep this but like the plan was there I can see what they were trying to do in another colour this might look better like this in a black if you suit black would be beautiful um, and I know they did a lilac as well but like you know when Sheen the, the post photos and then so like it's a white top and then they're selling it in like blue black and pink and all they've done is literally take that top and photoshop it that was this so I was a little bit like sceptical of getting a purple or something because I knew whatever colour it was on the website wasn't going to be authentic. Clearly the same thing happened to me with this top. But like I said, like I can see where they were going with it and I understand the process. Should we try it with the... come on then, let's try it with the sunglasses. See like you had the sunglasses in the bag and it's not even as bad but I don't know. I do love this bag though, I am obsessed. Okay, so final outfit, final outfit change. Um, the jacket isn't from Sheen, but the dress is. I've got the jacket over the top because I had dairy last night, so I look a little bit pregnant this morning. Just while we're getting rid of that lactose bloat, but it will be gone soon. Um, but this is the dress I've got. I know that it's very summer, like, just gone. I'm going to show you the dress without the jacket. It's literally just one of these sage green ruched on the side type of dresses you'll have seen them before like literally Zara made them really popular and a few other places made them quite popular um I've only just bought one and it's because I've only just found the sage green colour that is in stock and in my size so I will be wearing this at some point but probably we're going to bring this maybe into March April time spring summer that would be really cute again it just goes perfectly with the bag yeah, but for like keeping trendy for the time being, I feel like these are really such, just some cute pieces at the moment. And at the moment I'm loving the brown trend and I don't see it as much of a trend but more like a seasonal colour. So a lot of people wear black, I just love dark brown, dark brown is my black. So I will continue to wear this, probably not throughout spring and summer, I'm definitely going to bring out the pastels and the pinks because that's my favourite. But come August, September I'll definitely pull back out the browns and we can vibe with them again. But yeah, that is it. I literally, I don't have anything else left to show you guys. I thought I had more than that. But then saying that, this whole haul came to £80, which I mean, considering I got a tracksuit, three tops, a dress, some trousers, and accessories, is actually really quite good going. I understand now why it's not sustainable, but it is what it is. So if you guys enjoyed this video, then don't forget to give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe as well. I would love to hit 3,000 subscribers like end of March, April time, that's sort of my goal for me. So if you want to make that happen, then don't forget to subscribe and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.